We are your area news team. With your local and area news this morning, this is Justin Mott. This news, the Center Fire Department and West Shelby County Fire Departments responded to a possible structure fire earlier this morning located on County Road 1037 between Center and Nacogdoches. There was a stabbing in DeSoto Parish that occurred late on January the 16th. The DeSoto Parish Sheriff's Office received a call about a bleeding individual in the 300 block of Meadow Drive in Gloucester, Louisiana. Deputies responded to the area and located an adult male victim who had been stabbed multiple times. Deputies detained a suspect in the area and later identified him as Dylan D. Johnson. Johnson admitted to stabbing the victim and was arrested on the charge of attempted second-degree murder. There is a bull water notice in effect for the Denning Rural Water System. Once again, there is a bull water notice in effect for the Denning Rural Water System. In school news this morning, it's time for your Shelbyville Dragon Report. Good morning, Shelbyville. This is Mario Osby again. Hey, I'd like to thank everybody for all their support over the last couple of days. Appreciate everyone in the community coming together. Our junior high games with Joaquin has been canceled. Uh, Friday, we'll be traveling to Joaquin for our varsity game. Start time will be at 5 o'clock. Also, our UIL will be competing over at Tyler in the White House area. Uh, thank you again for all the support that you do with our Dragons. And in school closures and delays, I just have one this morning. Tenaha ISD is closed due to a flu outbreak. They plan to disinfect the school and reopen again on Monday the 22nd. Now, extracurricular activities are planned to continue at this time. At Joaquin ISD, they have a parent-teacher organization meeting today starting at 3.30 p.m. At St. Augustine ISD, the Cozy Cafe is going to be open on January the 19th at 4.30 p.m. That is the St. Augustine High School Culinary Arts Department Food Program. Now, for more information on this, you can contact Alicia Matthews at St. Augustine ISD at 275-9603. That's 275-9603. The Timpson Chamber Banquet is going to be held tonight at 5.30 p.m. at the Soso Park Building. The St. Augustine County Chamber of Commerce is going to have their awards gala tonight at 6 p.m. at the Historic Museum Theater. And in your rest report this morning, the Shelby County Sheriff's Office would like to report the rest of Aubrey Neal Graves, age 47, of Center, and Jessica Hedges, age 32, of Center. Both were arrested by the St. Augustine County Sheriff's Department and... They were arrested for the charges of abandoning and endangering a child. In your weather, current temperature in center is around 12 degrees. Yes, 12 degrees. And for more information on school events, sports, local news, community news, and video news, visit our website at cbc-radio.com. That's cbc-radio.com. Or you can check us out on Facebook at Center Broadcasting Company on Facebook. That's Center Broadcasting Company on Facebook. This has been Justin Mott with your local and area news.